it is pouring down. I don't know whether you just saw that flash of lightning. Um, Harriet has gone to hide and she's not in her usual hiding place. So I'm going to have to search for her. Oh, <laughs> where you just come from? Hello, my baby. I was just going to look for you. Have you eaten your dinner? Hmm? Have you eaten your dinner? You're such a good little girl. What? Yeah, she'll jump up. She's so clever. What's it doing? Thunder and lightning out there, you don't want to look out the window. Oh no. No, 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 no. Come on. Down you get. Let's go and see if you're eating your dinner. Shall we? I think we can start feeding you again downstairs anyway now. Harriet! 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 Everybody loves you. Well, almost everybody. Did you see that bird then? Hmm? I don't know whether I should give her a trim. Just to keep her beautiful figure and face. Oh dear, Harriet. Maybe I should let you have a baby or two. What do you think? Seems strange not to. But there's too many cats in the world anyway. Mm. <laughs> did you eat all your dinner? Let's go and have a look, shall we? Did you eat all your dinner? Yay. No. Harriet. Harriet. Who's beautiful? Who's beautiful? Come on. Let's see if you've had your dinner. I've, look, I've eaten mine on my bed. Come on then. Harriet wasn't interested in chips and salad. <laughs> Thankfully. I love this room. It's so welcoming and has a good vibe to it as well, you know. Um, well, you can feel, you can feel the, you can feel the colours, you can see the colours. You can feel the colours. Didn't know that was going to be a, a cat's chair. <laughs> so this table, the other table I gave to my son, uh, he's pretty much in his conservatory, I think. But this one. See, 
opened up like that. It's opened up more than that. I've got um, animals underneath. Toy animals. Some of these toys. You keep the... No, she hasn't eaten it in a look. She's eating it out. Yet. It's because it's rude, isn't it? Watching it while she eats. So, you know, um, as I am filming, you can um, see. How unsteady I am on my feet, and I, I, well, not just on my feet. I'm, I'm unsteady constantly, and I think it must be the medication I'm taking it oh, as prescribed. Whereas before, I would just not, you know, not take it all. Um, but I'm taking it as prescribed, and I think it's having. Any effects on me? Um, I think it's too much. But at least it's keeping the pain harvested. Harvested. That's not the word. At least it's keeping the pain quietened. There she is, just like lightning. She'd eaten probably four or five spoonfuls. I'm going to throw that away then because I'm not messing about, Harriet. Move it for an hour and then in the bin with them left. Right, going to brighten up again in a minute, to, just to fool you. Hey, Harriet, cheeky face. Oi, Harriet, what are you doing? Oh no. They're your curtains. Did you climb up them? Hmm? <laughs> You're going up the wall like your mum. <laughs> I wouldn't do that, Harriet. It's going to be thunder and lightning. That will make you run. You coming down with my mate? Hmm? Let me take this down. So I do the chips in the air fryer and um I just get the um the paper out that I cooked it in, I mean, and put them on the plate, and I had that with a salad, didn't I? But you were not impressed at all. Please don't pull down the stairs, huh? John film. It wouldn't be good. I love that picture. That, I think that was um, possibly the last picture we bought together. 
It's from John Lewis by A. A. Fletcher. What are they? Are they little daisies? They look like daisies, but I think they're meant to be. I think they are wild roses. Sliding. Come on then. Follows me everywhere. Everywhere. Well that's gone. <laughs> At least it wasn't the flag chariot. Oh gosh. I'm glad that I've got to see the uh the consultant on the 12th, I think that's Wednesday, um, and it's, he's a really nice man, he's the one as well who um, suggested an epidural or what, I don't know actually whether he suggested it or whether I asked him about it, and he's agreed. Look at my washing out in the rain. That's the dress I had on this morning. And the sheet that was on my bed. Um, out. You're on the radiator up there, I've got the police, not that the radiator's going on. It's just there about the way. All the stuff, all the washing I brought in. I cannot get into my... ...downstairs loo, which is a bit of a nuisance because... My um, clothes dryer is there. Because of this darn Simba box. Simba. But the mattress came in. And what are these kitchen walls? Yeah. Six kitchen walls. Can move them tomorrow, but this Simba box. My son is going to take for me. No, 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 you're not going in there. No, no, no. Go in here if you want to. So those vases, the big one, I moved off the table in the kitchen. They're not real. Stop eating the plants. Pack it in. I'm going to have to get you some of that grass, aren't I? You can get in pots for indoors. Um, so I had to move the vases off the table because she kept putting her head in that big one and I could see her getting stuck. Hey, and I moved those little vases off there because she might knock them. Harriet, leave them alone. I wash those. I think we're round about the end now. The end of the house tour for you. Yes, I know. I'm trying to get somebody to say, Oh, I'll buy your house from you. 
What do you think? No, leave that vase alone. I moved it so you wouldn't. Oh dear. Do you want the telly on, Harriet? Okay, everybody. We'll see you tomorrow. Good night.